hear this. Hey, what's up guys again? It's your guy here, DJ Cliff, and I'm back with this nice video for you guys. So today is your day. We are talking about those guys who have been asking me, you know, uh, I'm having a problem joining these songs. So um, we have a special feature on the Cross DJ application, which is known as the Beat Grid Edition. So this Beat Grid Edition is just going to help you out on doing some quality transitions. And you guys going to like it. So first of all, if you're new to this channel, or if you're a new viewer, make sure first of all you subscribe, make sure you like, make sure you comment. Tell me something about what you've seen and what you've known about or what you've learned about this video. So uh, today I'm um, talking about Beat Grid Edition. It is a special feature for, uh, you know, there's some kind of tracks which have, I mean the beats are not well aligned. So you'll need to align those videos. So that they get in line so whenever you want to do kind of a transition or want to do a synchronization they are well aligned the beat does not go off key i mean it does not go the other way around than the current playing song so um this video is for you guys so i'll know i know you guys are gonna like it and i'll really appreciate it. so subscribing is worth and uh, it's a return for you loving this channel and really do more videos so let's keep watching this video and you're gonna learn it so let's go hey so like i've been telling you from the first of this video uh today it's your day i'm just gonna show you how you're going to use beat grid edition uh on the cross dj application so uh let's go straight to a point today go to this button we see here that's it i mean that's the setting button go to the advanced settings button there then go look for an option which says bit grid edition it's usually not ticked make sure you take it and so let's go back to our waveform and uh, edit this wave so that you can have a co i mean you can have quality transitions of your song so uh we see we have the orange uh wave and we have the oh, i mean the blue uh section here so these are the bits and the first bit should be somewhere there uh, so it's well aligned and you can see uh, the first bit in the blue side it's not well aligned so it should be somewhere here so it should be somewhere there so that when you do you want to do i mean your first quality scratch or want to do your transitions it should be well 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 aligned so you know transitions it's just about alignment and how you can do i mean uh, i mean um progressive uh, a bend or transitions it should be well well aligned that's the first thing you have to know um so like you i mean let me hope you have already i uh, mean activated or ticked that the bit grid edition and we can see we have the blue buttons and the orange buttons up there i mean you can i mean let me just show you what those buttons are if you tap those buttons you can see these things it is it's just the same we have the aerial and we have some some i mean the four sticks inside and the wire i mean the i mean the these are i mean there's some wire line there so uh that's the, it's just the same we have the x2 x2 half two half two and there's more uh i mean just leave it there so uh we are going to use the first button just to make sure that we aligned our webs the way we just wanted so um like you can see when i tap the cube button on the blue side uh the beat just jumps and it leaves the other side more from the line that's the lane nothing should be uh, more beyond this line if you want to do i mean quality scratches um i mean good transition so uh we need to edit this song so first of all let me just play this song and i try to illustrate what i'm just trying to say i mean when you what you mean you're playing a song and you want to join uh, this kind of a song on the blue side it will always just refuse it will always just refuse so this is how i'm just gonna show it to you sorry so let me align it and let me play it to you if you've just joined us stay on your radio if you are still with us stay off your nub
So guys, as much as you do, you cannot join these tracks together. So, uh, like I told you, make sure the first bit is just well aligned from this first line here. So that you cannot, you, as much as stray, the songs won't get aligned and you won't go, I mean, you cannot get good transitions on your track. So make sure, uh, let me just try to show you what you have to do so that this song, this song on the orange side has to be aligned or whatever song you're going to use. So um, make sure the first beat is there on the line and then tap the blue button because you're editing the blue side and then tap the first button which you can see some kind of an aerial and some smaller stick inside so tap it then tap the q button on the blue side then after tapping it make sure you remove these buttons at least when you want to come back and you want to do some maneuvers it's easier for you you just dip in i mean you just dig in and just try to do your kind of maneuver so you move it by tapping the wave uh wave button here you can see the wave button here so you know how to get into into that place i mean that section so like we can see it's already aligned let me just go back it's well aligned so let me just try to illustrate what i'm just trying to say yeah so guys i'm sorry for those noises it's just the microphone is recording it again and we have the internal recorder again so kind of you love to forgive me for that but i know what um, i mean you know what i'm just trying to say and you've got my point right so we can see the beat is just intact it just when we just tap the q button it's just straight it does not lag behind or it does not go or it does not skip the beats so we want to try to align it and see if you're going to i mean you want to i mean you want to do a mix and see if it's going to go in as you can as you can see you can be good you can do quality scratches but when it comes to beat gradition you have to also be perfect so that when you want to do your songs i mean you have to do your transitions they have to be well aligned they have to be straight and so that you can get the quality scratches so that i mean even transitions even if your listener want to listen to your to mixes will be well i mean he will love it or she will love it so let me just record this song for you and you guys are gonna like it so let's Dig in. If you've just, just joined us, stay on your radio. If you're still with us, stay off your nub. Wow, 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 wow. That has been so nice. Anyway, it was just an illustration and I'll show you in my future video. I'll also do a, a kind of a, a mix, full mix, and you'll also see all these effects and you guys gonna like it. So if you're new to this channel, make sure you like it, please. Make sure you comment, make sure you share it to your friends and we can keep helping each other by just doing that. Uh, I really appreciate. I'm your only DJ, DJ Cliff. And I love you guys. So up to next time, make sure you comment, make sure you tap the notification icon, I mean the not notification bell. So whenever I upload another video, you will always get to know and you will like it. So there's a next video and you guys, you gonna like it. So bye bye.